Hello everybody and welcome back to Evolving Vibes, the community for witches, pagans, spiritualists, and everybody in between. So you're probably wondering where the hell I am today, right? So I'm in Chapachet, Rhode Island right now. And as you look behind me, you see these trees. This town is just a wonderful, small New England town that's cut directly out of history. And it's a wonderful little spot and a very magical location. Which brings me to my second point. Um, I'm here today celebrating the relocation of the Dragonfly Apothecary. If you remember the other video that I had before, it was an introduction to the Dragonfly and to Rob and Lisa, the owners of the Dragonfly. So today is just the next evolution on their path and on their journey with the Dragonfly. And we're going to show you its new location, some of the things from within. But this time, we're going to have Rob introduce himself and really spend some time with you going through the shop because this is his passion and this is his absolute path and journey, him and Lisa's. So, I will see you on the other side of that camera in just a couple of minutes. Hi, this is Rob from the Dragonfly Apothecary. Lisa and I want to show you some new stuff that we have to offer here at the new location in Chapachet, Rhode Island at 15 Money Hill Road, right behind the Village Bean Cafe. So come on down, grab yourself a coffee, and come on in. First thing you'll see when we get here is my wonderful, beautiful fish tank, my good friend Paul Gagnon, Help to get it here from its old location in Cranston. And the fish are happy and thriving. They love their environment. How could they not? It's filled with crystals. They're a happy fish. So as you come into our shop, you're greeted by crystals everywhere. First, we have our little amethyst section set up here. We have an amethyst cathedral, an amethyst slice, some smaller pieces. This is a beautiful piece on agate. And we have our Buddhas displayed here as well, because Buddha and Amethyst, what goes better together than that? In this area here, you're going to see all of our loose crystals, which are sold by the each. They come with a nice little velvet pouch to hold them. And uh, we recommend that you carry them with you every day. You know, people carry everything else with them. Why not carry a crystal with you? You feel the power that it possesses and that it helps you through the day. Put it in a pouch, stick it in your pocket. Speaking of crystals, we recently redid this display case here with the help of my good friend Brian from Evolving Vibes. We, we uh, took out some of the artwork I had in here and we have uh, replaced it with all natural crystals, rock formations. There's a few little stands here and there to add to it, but uh, the feeling that you get looking at this display it just gives you peace and solitude. Gotcha. We also have available in this case a handmade sculpted pendulums. Uh, I have a uh, local person that's making these for me. And they're available just as low as a price that you find on a regular pendulum, you know, a man-made processed one. These are all hand done. Uh, I know the girl personally. She does great work, and I'm sure you'll like working with her product. Of course, we have a full array of incense, uh, a lineup from everything from the Satya, the Nag Champa. We have fresh Palo Santo available. We have fresh sage. Uh, we also have, if you come follow me, we have these wonderfully hand rolled hand-dipped frankincense, sage, dragon's blood, Palo Santo sticks. They're a dollar each, nine dollars for ten of them. And uh, let me tell you, they burn longer than any incense stick I've ever burnt. They're made by my good friend. And not only does he make the incense, but he's also, he makes these wands. His name is Paul Gagnon of Wood Alchemy, and these are his fantastic creations. So if you'd like to have a wand to have on your, your altar at home or on your display piece, the mantle, we have them available from uh, double crystals, triple crystals. Maybe it's uh, you're a young wizard and you just need one without a crystal. $25, handmade. You can't get anything better. And they come with these little stands. They're wonderful. And this area here is our statuary area. 
We have imported hand carved from Bali statues. We have home handmade uh, little gnomes as well. We have antique Buddhas. We have hand carved Buddhas. And we have a full selection of these wonderful. We have uh, mugs. And in this crystal case, we have everything from amethyst to calcite to blue aragonite to bismuth. If we don't have what you're looking for in this case, chances are you can't find it right now. Because I even have it. It's not in this case, but maybe we'll show it to you later. We do have some moldavite here in the shop. And this is a whole new room for us here at the Dragonfly Apothecary. This would be more of an apothecary type room. Here we have a line of organic teas. We have all of our witchy herbs, anything you might need to do your spell work. We also have handmade ritual salts, black salt from our friend at Evolving Vibes as well. We also have every many herbs as possible in a uh, little bell jar five dollars cleaver's herb lemon balm nettle you name it we have it if we don't have it we'll get it here we have our full line of byron organic teas we have them in these wonderful little canisters or we also have them by the bag the loose if you prefer to use a, a tea ball at home we have some teapots available handmade tea cozies to keep your pot warm and we also have a new book and kit on tea leaf reading, something we'll be offering soon here at the Apothecary. And next to it, those are our new spell kits, all hand done from a company in Maine. Everything is included in this kit that you need to do the spell work in your life that you need to have done. Talking about spell work, in this corner here, we have just about everything you need, whether it be literature on how to do these spells, the candles to do them with. Uh, we also have kits all set up for you, hand done, with the, the candle and the herbs to go with it. We have witchy balls, we have cauldrons, anything you possibly want, we have it here in this little corner. Hopefully this corner will be getting bigger and bigger. Oh, and, and say you need a, a a new deck, but you don't want to spend a lot of money. Any deck that I open that we don't use here at the shop, I offer it as an open box price, $10 each. Welcome to my inner sanctum. This is the tarot reading room. We're going to offer lots of different services from this room, such as hypnotherapy and classes on tarot, classes on meditation. And I'm happy to welcome you here and come in any day for a reading. Call up, schedule an appointment. We'll be happy to sit with you. I want to thank everybody for stopping by today. I especially want to thank my good friend Brian from Evolving Vibes for helping produce this video. I want to know what you folks think. Brian and I both want to know what you think. Drop a note in the comment. Hit us up on Instagram. Hit us up on Facebook. We look forward to talking to you soon. Peace. Thanks, Rob. That was awesome. I wanted Rob to really be a part of this video introduced to the Dragonfly for a couple of reasons. One, it's his passion, is what he loves. Him and Lisa have put their all into this shop. And along with that, I wanted to have his energy be communicated over the video to everybody so you can see what the heart and soul of a small business really, really entails. Um, if you're in the area, definitely feel free to swing by Chapachet, Rhode Island. It's a wonderful little town, a lot of history, um, small villages and just really, really wonderful areas that you can actually see and participate in. And along with that, it's got this really wonderful and cool cemetery that I hope you do, um, if you're in the area, get to check out. If you're not in the area, I do have in the um, description area all of the contact information for the Dragonfly Apothecary. If you want to reach out to Rob, feel free. If you want to go on one of his social media accounts and subscribe or like, feel free to do that as well. And let's not forget, make sure I leave in the comments some of the things that you think, maybe what you have uh, for shops available near you, and what you think of the Dragonfly Apothecary, as well as Rob. 
And if you haven't done so already, please be sure, like, subscribe, leave me that comment, help grow the community, and let me know what you think about some of the content I've already put on the, um, the channel. And make sure, like one of these two videos, or actually I should say, watch one of these two videos and then like it, and help the community grow yet again. Until next time, please, as always, be safe, be well, and be blessed.